congratulations on the book and the success and now thank the you. movie. I know, thank you. Uh, when you heard that Stephen was coming on, you must have been delighted, I mean, beyond delighted that he was going to yes. come on and bring this to life for you. You know, well, I had like a few minutes of just total elation and then, uh, uh, you know, because I just heard he was interested in reading it and he was going to decide and it took two weeks and those were the longest two weeks of my life, you know, and as soon as they told me I was elated, but then suddenly I got very depressed because I assumed he would he would read it and pass on it and then I would have to spend the whole rest of my life imagining what it would have been like if Steven Spielberg had read Ready Player One. Luckily, I don't have to imagine uh, now. Now we can all see it, uh, but... Uh, it, that was a long two weeks. Uh, that was just, and that was three years ago, uh, uh, this month, uh, that he came on board, and it's been the best three years of my life. I can imagine. I yeah. mean, I know a lot of, with a lot of book adaptations, they sometimes bring the right one, sometimes they take it away, and blah, blah, blah. But it must have been great that you were part of the process from the beginning into the movie. No, I, you know, what happened to me should happen to every novelist who gets their work adapted, you know. Uh, I'm lucky because I was a screenwriter, and that allowed me to be more included in the process, and also I was not too precious the way some writers are. I knew uh, that I had written, you know, uh, uh, something that worked on on the page, but it would require changes to work on the big screen to make things more cinematic. So, you know, you don't have somebody stopping to play a, a six-hour game of Pac-Man in the middle of the movie. It works in the book, but would not work in the movie, and I, so I knew we would have to uh, condense things and uh, and make changes. Uh, and it was that was the most fun I've ever had, is uh, kind of reworking my story with Steven Spielberg to make it more cinematic, and, you know, he pulled it off. I can imagine you were super excited to see the visuals that he was going to bring, but when you saw exactly how it was, and we've seen the trailer, all these characters, I mean, that must have just been a dream come true. No, I still can't get over it, you know, it's, and it's not just Steven, it's our amazing production designer, Adam Stockhausen, and all the best concept artists, and ILM, and Digital Domain, uh, who, you know, uh, shaped all the special effects of my childhood, uh, you know, uh, all bringing all these, you know, they say... They say, be bold and powerful forces will come to your aid. And I am a testament to, you know, how that can happen. Well, I wish you all the luck in the world. Thank you so much uh, for stopping. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you mate. Guys. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is yeah. that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey You Guys.